Hey everybody and welcome to the channel. Today I'm working on a little project. It's an intro logo kind of uh, glitchy effect going on and I'm using an adjustment layer to create this effect and initially I was using a black background and I just wanted to apply that effect to the logo itself and it was working great. And just to give you an idea I'm going to hit play here and show you what happens. Okay, so real simple intro, and as you can see, it's affecting the background, it's affecting everything. Where it, When I only had the black background, it was actually just doing the logo, or it looked as though it was just doing the logo. So I needed to find a way to just affect the logo, but not affect the background. So I figured out a way to do that, and it's real simple. I'll show you. You just select all the layers that are adjustment layers, and then you're going to set select the images that you want to affect, in this case the logo. I don't want to uh, affect anything else. So once you've got everything selected here, you're going to right click and select on pre-compose. You're not going to select anything else. Uh, you want to have this selected. It should be automatically selected like that. Click OK. And now you have this new adjustment layer that's been pre-composed. And so basically it's connecting all those adjustment layers into this one layer and it's only going to affect the logo. So now if we replay this you'll see my background stays where I need it and the logo is affected. So that's exactly what I was going for. So if you're having this problem that's uh, how you do it. If you're only using like one adjustment layer you would just select that single adjustment layer but basically you're going to select the adjustment layer and the objects that you want it to affect and then compose them all and this is the result you get so if this helped you out give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe please click that bell up there in the corner and i'll see you guys in my next video